let's talk about mental health. Specifically, let's talk about mental health in an industry where your self-worth is often dictated by somebody else's opinion and by algorithms. You see, when you create something, you almost instinctually want to share it with others because you're proud of what you created and you should be. But that perception can sometimes change because of someone else's opinion. Maybe you should stop listening to them. When you put something out there and people respond positively, those positive comments feel great. But your mind can't help but to focus on the 1% of negative comments. You see, I put a new song out in November, and even though I wrote the song, I had no clue what it was about. And to give you a little background about this, if you haven't heard the song, I ask that you go check it out. But the chorus says, I don't wanna be alone, I don't wanna be with you. And for the longest time, I attributed that to a relationship because that's the most sensible reason, right? I don't wanna be alone, but I don't wanna be with you. Of course it's about a relationship, but it wasn't. It was, but it was a relationship with myself. I was going through a really hard time when I wrote this song. And so I didn't wanna be alone, but I didn't wanna be with this manic, depressed version of myself. You might be asking yourself, well, why wouldn't you want to be without this depressed version of you? And it's really hard to explain. I'm in no way comparing myself to Kurt Cobain, but he once said, I miss the comfort in being sad. And that might seem completely foreign to you. And that's great. But the thing is, is when feeling sad and depressed is your baseline, it becomes your comfort zone. We normalize that. And so you would rather feel that than nothing. And even though I said it in my way, it's the same message. I didn't want to be alone, but I didn't want to be with this other version of myself. And if we readdress the creative side to mental health, my best advice is create for you. All the other numbers won't matter if you're creating for you, because when you do that, you're immediately successful. If your only bar for success is creation, then when you create something, you're automatically successful. The numbers, the likes, the comments, none of that matters because you're already successful. That is something that I put a lot of practice into. I don't put out anything, anything that I don't stand behind. And by doing that, I stay accountable to myself. I can't determine what you like, what you don't like. What I can do is stay true to myself and you can do that too. I love all of you beautiful people and I'll see you next Friday.